Yes, this might be heaven, a place that combines craft beer and dogs. Hi, Lucy Lou. If you're in the market for some absolute joy. Good girl. Step inside Ales and Tails. It's basically guaranteed. A dream come true. Owner Taz Logan turned nearly 6,000 square feet of warehouse space into her ideal hangout, an indoor dog park and tap room. Merging her passions for craft beer, she's worked in the industry since 2009, and dogs, who she trains and shows. Baker, hi buddy, what you doing? People are not offended when I remember their dogs' names and not theirs. I can almost like tell you who's barking by the bark, you know, like a baby cries, moms always know. Doggy daycare is available Monday through Friday, and in the evenings, Ales and Tails opens for park play and pints. My dogs are behind the bar. 16 rotating taps feature craft beer from around the Northwest. There are also non-alcoholic choices, including one for the four-legged crowd. I do have a beer made for dogs by another local company. There are three requirements for entry. Dogs need up-to-date vaccinations, humans need to be 21 or over, and... You have to be a dog lover. But not a dog owner. Plenty of people come in just for the atmosphere. Everyone is welcome to toss a ball, decorate the walls, or simply sit and stay. No breed restrictions, no size restrictions. Just one big happy pack. Harper is the first lifetime member here. The idea of an indoor dog park uh, just really caught our attention with all the rain, you know, half the year. It's just a good environment for people and dogs both. It's the place Taz Logan dreamed about. The ales, the tails, and the way both bring people together. Every dog is a learning experience and endless love, constantly.